No, I've never met them before, Aaron. No. Earlier you mentioned the bear story. Oh, bears. Yeah, so so basically the first episode, episode 14 that I appeared in in season one, um, before going on set, I get like this bulletin warning on email that says, what do you do when you see a bear? I was like, what? <laughs> <laughs> I'm from Hong Kong. We have dogs and cats. And that's it. Um, and it was, it was crazy. Like, you know, make sure that your trailer trash is the trash in the trailer trash. The trash in your trailer is covered up. Um, if you do see a bear, don't run because it will attack you. I'm like, yeah, right. A bear is, oh, and then here's the other one. If a bear starts to run towards you, it's going to stop 10 feet bef- like in front of you because it's going to test you. I'm like, really? A bear is going to charge at me and I'm just going to be like, yeah, I'll just chill here. <laughs> like, I don't know. Um, so that, that was, and Manu saw, saw a bear. And I remember him going, oh, da, you know, he all goes, hey, darling, guess what? I just saw a bear. <laughs> I'm going to take a photo of the bear. I'm like, uh. <laughs> <laughs> no. I think any of the Spartacus stuff is going to save you there. Or any of my kung fu. Um, and, yeah, bears. And, you know, when I, when I went, my trailer was the furthest from everybody else's. Beautiful view at the entire nature and the mountains and stuff, which also means that's where all the bears are hanging out. <laughs> so I was like, oh my God, what's going to happen? Um, I, when I was in upstate New York, I saw a bear for the first time, and I literally thought it was a dog. It was a small bear, but it just didn't register in my head. A black, little black bear? It was, yeah, it was a little black bear. Yeah. And you know, it was on all fours, and it was just staring at me, and I, I had my phone out. Like, I was, I was, what was I doing? I guess I was taking photos, and I was like, what is that? That's a really big, oh. And then I started to like walk back and then I turned around to my friends. I'm like, there's a bear, there's a bear. And everyone started like singing and waving their hands and talking really loud. I was like, oh my God. But yeah, city girl, so. Oh wait, what, at least you begin martial arts training? I didn't really do formal training as a kid. My dad used to just play fight with us. So he, you know, he taught us to block, kick, punch, and we would be at the bus stop waiting for a bus, and he would just punch, 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 block, block, block. I, I don't know, three, four, five, maybe. I, I, my father, who's an incredible martial artist, still is, and he's in his 60s, he told me, well, actually, I learned the hard way, first of all. He says, don't ever surprise me. And I like, I think I jumped out at him from a, you know, the, s- the side of a corridor when he was coming out. And I was like, boo. And he literally punched me in the stomach. My <laughs> reflex, of which I went flying onto the ground. <laughs> passed out for like two minutes. My mom's screaming. And I wake up and I go, whoa. That was, <laughs> that was awesome. Can we yeah, do this again? I, like, I want to learn how to do that. It's the only it's the only household where you get beat up by your dad and you don't call the police. <laughs> um, but yeah, I, we still play fight. My sister, my dad, and it's fun. It's really fun. And the number of times that I was bullied as a kid, I, I was bullied a lot as a child. I was bullied in school, and I would come back, and my mom would always be the diplomatic person and be like, "Go to the principal and tell them what happened." And there, it was it was a, I went to a bit of a racist school, unfortunately. Funnily enough, I was like the, the Westerner in a Chinese local school. So it was, it was tough, you know, it was different looking. As a kid, kids are kids. If you look different, they're going to they're gonna treat you differently. You're the odd one out. Um, so, you know, I, I, was, I was bullied by some kids, and, and my dad taught me how to throw them on the ground, like judo throw them. Or like next time they, they hit you, you kick them in the stomach because they're not going to, you know, leave, leave marks or... And, he was that kind of dad, <laughs> but it, it, it worked. You know, when the boys bullied me, that was it. One kick to the stomach, they never came back. <laughs> so, it, you know, when, when the diploma, dipl- diplomatic way didn't work, it, it worked, so. Any other questions back there? Yeah, it's hard for one more question. One more question. Oh, okay, two more questions, two hands raised, sorry. Do you think that uh, Steven's character Absolutely. I want to see that too. Absolutely. I don't know. It's a good Wait, he, he had his hand up. Okay. My 
favorite. My favorite, well, for my character, my favorite quote is, and I sign on the autographs, is, journey of a thousand miles, miles begins with a single step. Yeah, yeah. I love, I love It's a great quote. quote. All right, quickly. Okay, uh, I don't know if Arrow had any impact on this, but what's your favorite superhero and supervillain? My favorite superhero and supervillain? Ooh, that's a tough one. My favorite superhero? Is it bad that I put Marvel? No. <laughs> yeah, no. I hope Marvel. Oh, I don't know. Uh, Okay, fine. DC Comics is definitely Batman. DC Comics. And actually, the super villain Joker, too. Batman. I think Iron Man would be Marvel. Uh, I don't know. But uh, it's because it's Robert Downey Jr. is yeah. such a good actor Iron that Man he made Robert. Iron Man so cool. Yeah, he did. But Wolverine, too. Okay, I gotta go. No, huh? No? Oh. I feel like she's like, hurry up. Oh, group shot? Yeah, that'd be cool. Everybody, get together. You can hold this correctly. I suppose and correctly. Tweet it. Yeah. Oh, that's probably why. Man, you guys did a whole panel with no microphone. Yeah, but microphones are useful. They give you power. Excuse me. I'm sure. The power's in here. The power within. Exactly. The power within. Right, should we do it like this? The power within. Yeah. Maybe. Okay. The power within. Maybe you stand. There we go. Maybe you stand on the stage and we'll stand behind you. Should we? Uh, should, like people who who can't.